So I'm Chase Corn. I've been here for six years and I'm an orthopedic foot and ankle specialist. So a total ankle replacement is a, is a surgical procedure where we take an arthritic ankle, we remove the damaged bone and cartilage and replace that with metal and plastic parts to help retain the motion of that joint. So unlike hip and knee replacements, which are primary for wear and tear arthritis of the hip and knee, ankle replacements are most commonly the result of post-traumatic arthritis. So these are patients who have had ankle injuries in the past, often fractures. Well, the benefits are, number one, it relieves the pain associated with the arthritic problem. Number two, again, because you're replacing the joint and not fusing the joint, you retain the motion and therefore the function. The technology has changed drastically over the past 10 years, all the way from implant designs into uh, the way that we basically use patients' information, CT scans and things like that to design implants that are specific to that patient. So the technology has really improved drastically over the last 10 years. I will always offer patients conservative management. If I feel I can make them better without surgery, and we'll try that you know, until they're ready to proceed or that fails. So non-operative treatment for ankle arthritis can range from uh, corticosteroid injections to arthritis medications, to bracing and physical therapy. All those things are, are commonly used to treat ankle arthritis. In a lot of cases, patients have had fairly extensive treatment before they get to that point and they're ready to move forward with surgery. And in some cases, that's appropriate at that time. So this is what a, a total ankle replacement looks like. So this is the talus bone. That's the bone in the foot that moves up and down in the ankle. And this is the tibia bone. In an ankle replacement, we replace the damaged bone and cartilage with metal parts there and there's plastic in between to allow them to move smoothly. The success rate quoted in the literature at this point is about 90% at 10 years. That means if you had a total ankle replacement in 10 years, there's a 90% chance you'll still have that ankle in and you'll be doing well with that replacement. If you came in and we feel like you're an appropriate candidate for, for an ankle replacement, the technology we use these days, there's about a four to five week turnover from the time the CT scan is done until the time the surgery actually occurs. So once the CT scan is done, you're looking at, again, four to five weeks till surgery. Uh, the surgery typically in the hospital one night after that, discharge the next day. And then some patients will go to rehab for a short period of time if, if we feel like they'd benefit from that. Typically, you're, you're in a cast or a splint for two weeks, and then you're in a walking boot for about four weeks after that. Then we're dealing with some physical therapy, which can last anywhere from a couple to six weeks after the surgery. We sort of pride ourselves on being a highly specialized group. So if you come to us with an ankle problem, we're gonna get you in the hands of, of an expert to deal with that problem. Someone who focuses just on, on ankle problems. And so I think, you know, just this is a reflection of the specialized training that we have and the specialized care that we offer our patients.